saw my live trades today? You didn't? This is how it worked. Happy Monday, traders. How are you today? So after five days without trading, well, actually, this is three days, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and the weekend. So five days that I'm not watching the charts. Well, I'm not watching the charts on the computer. Uh, a little bit on my cell phone, but that's okay. Today I traded, and today I traded two stocks, actually three stocks uh, in my strategy. ZM and NEO and I took MU because AMD. Now let's start with NEO. NEO was my first trade today. Okay, wow, now it's moving up nicely. So I waited with NEO because NEO it's a famous stock. People like to buy NEO for no reason. And today it opened with a gap up, which is what I want to see in extended strategy. I want to see a gap up. People still think, okay, this is a good stock to buy because today it's also gapping up. Waited for this shakeout. Okay, now we have a nice entry for a short. And why is that? Because we have support of one, two, three, four minutes. Okay, 41.75. That means that I can short it under 41.75 with 20 cents stop loss. Got me in, beautiful entry. Moved a little bit against me for a small retest. Moved down, took my first target, 41.30. Took my second target when it moved under 41. Then I added under this candle, 41.31. And I closed everything above 41.55 here. So Neo, beautiful start for this week. And I took it for a short because of its daily chart. You can see that Neo bounced from the 200 SMA. This is the black line, 200 SMA. Moved up from 34 to 41, 42 in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven days. This is more than 20%. So I assume today we're going to see a small pullback, which we did. Actually, now Neo is moving back up. Maybe it's a nice opportunity to short it, but I'm done for today. So Neo, my first trade for today, I'm up 1900. Then I took ZM again because of its daily chart. You can see that ZM with three green cans in a row. So I thought today we're going to see it moving lower. Took it for a short under 336. Took small share size because that was pretty. Spiked me in beautiful entry. Again, retest and then it dropped. Took my first target. 331 and I took another part at 330. I said in the room, guys, this is too extended. I'm going to cover some more. And I closed everything above this. It spiked me out for a few cents here. And the last trade of the day, MU, which now moving up. I took it for a long above this line, 87.30 because Someone wrote in the room, guys, take a look on AMD, it's exploding. So I watched MU and I assumed that MU is going to follow AMD. I took it for a long, spiked sharply lower. I waited and then I said, you know what? I'm going to close it here with a small loss of 818. Actually, I took it with 30 cents stop loss. So this is my risk unit. So the first day of this week, Monday, I'm up. $2,900, which is great. Always good to open a green week. And that's it for me, traders. Thank you for watching today's recap. Don't forget to help my channel and press the thumb up and subscribe my channel. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching.